one of my Facebook followers is living in South Africa right now. And she don't believe how God bless her life. She don't believe it. Sometimes she think that no, this is not me. This can't be me. This is impossible. You know what? Uh, she was living in one of the villages in Ghana. And in their village, there is no light. Even before they can get good water to drink, they need to travel far away before they can get clean water. Someone died in their village. So many people came to the funeral. One man saw this woman. The man proposed to her. He got married. Then the man took the woman from the village to South Africa. So right now the woman don't believe, no, this is not me. This can't be me. This is impossible. Because of the work her husband is doing, people salute her. Many people salute her. So she thinks, no, I don't deserve it. I don't deserve it. Let me tell you something. Things which you think you don't deserve it at the right time, you deserve it because of the grace of God. My brother, my sister, there's something I want to tell you about God Almighty. The grace and the blessings of God is not about discrimination. The blessings and the grace of God is not about your poor family background. It's not about your education background. It's not about your location. It's not about what you are going through or what people are saying against you. But it's, a, it's about the time. That's why God's time is always the best. So all what you are going through, everything will pass. There is time for everything. There is time to weep. And there is time to enjoy. Sometimes many people will give up on yourself. Yes, it's good to give up on yourself. Because the fight is not your fight. You can't use your mind. You can't use your strength. God shall fight for you. You shall overcome every obstacles. You shall overcome every principalities. So never tell yourself that you are late. Nobody is late on this planet. Nobody is late. Never tell yourself that you are late. You are never late. Those who are late, those who didn't finish their mission, they are in the cemetery. Life means hope. So there is hope for you. Nothing is late for you. Look at this woman. She was in the village. She wasn't expecting this grace. She wasn't expecting these blessings. But look at what God did for her. Now she don't believe it. This is what God will do for you. You will never believe it. You can give up on yourself. The reason why you need to give up, give up on yourself is because you can't fight your own fight. You can't use your strength. You can't use your mind without God. So it's about time we need to tell God our problems than to fight for our own, our own problems. Only God can fight for us. God doesn't care your location, the blessings of God. God doesn't care about what you are going through or what people are saying against you. God will bless you at the right time. And all those who are disgracing you, all those who think you are hopeless, they will salute you at the right time. Sometimes because you are poor, because you have nothing, people will disrespect you. People will not respect you because, of, because you don't have money. But at the right time, all these people are going to salute you because God is going to open new door for you. When God wants to bless you, God don't just bless you. God bless you and also God will protect you from your enemies. God will protect you from every obstacle. So never tell yourself that you are late. Nobody is late on this planet. Maybe you are living in the village. It doesn't mean that the end of your life. God will locate you to different places. God will bless you in different ways. So God has time for every blessing. So when your time is not up for God to bless my brother, my sister, never give up. Don't tell yourself that you are late. Nobody is late on this planet. As far as you are still alive. So at the right time, God will bless you. You will laugh. You have a good testimony. It will shock your enemies. Those who are saying you are nothing, nothing good will ever come to your life. My brother, my sister, don't listen to them. They don't know what God has planned for you. They don't know the capabilities of the capable God. 
So don't listen to voices, but listen to God Almighty, because only God can bless your life. Only God can change things in your life. There is time for everything, and at the right time, God will bless you. And nobody can change this time. Nobody can change the mind of God when God wants to bless you. So it's not about where you are living. It's not about what you are going through. It's not about what people are saying against you. But it's about the time. So let's wait upon the Lord. And at the right time, you mount like ego. You run without worry. And when God makes you as an ego, my brother, my sister, where people will never go, the moment you step your foot there, they are going to salute you because of the grace of God. Because you are under the canopy of God. And with God, all things are possible. So never give up on God. You can give up on yourself because the fight is not your fight. But never give up on God. God has time for every blessing. So when your time is not up to receive it, my brother, my sister, never give up on God. Keep on praying. God will open a new door for you. You have testimony. So never give up. Always I advise people, I motivate people, I encourage people. That they need to wait upon the Lord because God holds your blessing. Nobody holds your blessing. So when people are telling you things which God has not planned for you, my brother, my sister, don't listen to people, don't listen to voices. If you listen to voices, my brother, my sister, you will give up on God and you never receive the blessings of God. So we should always focus on God so that God can bless our life. As you're watching me right now, may God bless you. May God change your life. May God answer your prayer so that you too can have good testimony. May God guide you all the days of your life, you and your family, in Jesus Christ's name. This is your to Mr. Jerry. You can subscribe on my YouTube channel. If you go to Mr. Jerry GH on YouTube, you can subscribe. I've got many videos you can watch. You can motivate yourself. You can share it to your friends. You can download it. You can share it wherever you want. The message is for you. God bless you. We shall meet again.